Hello, my name is Hector. Welcome back to Sky Factory 3. We are back. We are back. You thought I'd gone again. You thought I'd gone again. I had to take a couple of days off just for some for reasons and things. Uh, but we are back. We are back. Don't worry. We've not finished. We are also close. I'm not finishing now. We've still got, you know, just a few little things left to do. Uh, between things, our oh man jump between two tame dragons while in mid air while both are flying. I am looking forward to that particular achievement. Um, but today we are going to be working. I think I would like to work on something that isn't in the achievement thing, but I kind of want it. I I really do. I want some chaotic solar panels. Um, and you get three of them for four. Draconic solar panels. I can't remember. We just okay. We can just craft those. That's pretty good. Uh, and we need to use chaos shards for them. But we need the chaotic tier. So we need eight of these guys. Eight. That is a lot. And uh, we need to use dragon eggs. So I need some more dragon eggs, and then I need eight of these chaotic cores. And that is wow. That is a lot of stuff. So I need eight of these. That's four. Awakened cores per one chaotic core, so that four times eight is 32. I need 32 awakened cores, man. Man, oh man, that is a lot. So I need 32 nether stars. Then I need two stacks of nether stars just to make the wyvern cores, the wyvern cores, whatever they are. That is a lot of stuff. That is a lot of stuff. So we are going to be starting this today. Well, I, I want to finish it today as well. Um, but um, let's let's have a little look-see. So nether, nether stars. So we need at least 32 just for that. Okay. Then we needed um, uh, one core. We need, can I, have I, no, I haven't. I haven't. That is annoying. Maybe we make a crafting recipe for that. That would be a good thing. I think... To do, there we go, pattern, yes, excellent, that will help us, I think, that will be a good thing to do, so how's everyone doing, I hope you're doing well, hope you're having a good day, wherever you may be, I'm having a pretty good day so far, pretty good day, right, core, back to cores, so I needed 32 of them, was it, 32, Um. there we go, let's just do that, So I'll have to craft some of these as well. Oh, but we've got them. We've got them. So, oh, uh, a little bit more. 32. There we go. Right. What else did we need? We needed, so we need five times, what was it? How many of these do we need? 32, which is 150. Uh, right. Hang on. Five times. What, 32 I'm doing? Right, okay, so 10, so 160? 160 awakened? Oh, wow, that is a lot. That is... that. is... I'm not going to have enough, am I? 160. How many of these do I have? No, wow, wow. I need so many more of these as well. This is going to be a tall order. And then we also we also need... Um, I need some crystally things. What are they called? I need some of these guys, and I need four per dragon. I think I've got two dragon eggs, so I need another six. So four times six is twenty-four. Um, so twenty. Can I? Can we? Yes. Can we finish that? Right. Okay. So, got twenty-four of these, so I can respawn the dragon. That is good. I'll get some dragon hearts from there as well. We can make some more awakened draconium. Hopefully we can make enough just to do that. What else do we need? Wow, this is turning into quite quite the order, but that's why I think we should do it because it's, you know, it's high level stuff and I'm kind of surprised that this isn't an achievement actually in a in a way. Um what else do we need? We need these guys. I can't remember what tier we have. Um I've taken up away my um my thing that was there, my, uh, what was it called, travel anchor. But let's go have a little look-see what level these are. Ah, these are only solar panel sixes. Let's have a look. I can't even remember what the last tier was. Ah, ah ha ha ha. So, oh dear, we need another, we need another four dragon eggs. <laughs> oh, we need another four dragon eggs. Okay, so that is that. 
with that. Wow. Wow. That is quite a hefty um quite a hefty thing. So another four dragon eggs. Crystals. Where are you? So uh another sixteen of these. And I've got no more pains. Of course I haven't. Of course I haven't. Pain. There we go. Do that quickly. There we go. That should hopefully do it. Go back to that. Chris. Chris. No. <laughs> Come on. Crystal. There we go. So we've got one there. And then... That many. Yes. Okay. So that should give us the amount of dragon eggs that we require. I need a piston to get them. There we go. I've got a lever already. Uh, and then we're going to set up doing that. So I'm going to... I'm going to go to the end and just get myself some more dragon eggs to begin with. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll hopefully set this up kind of semi-auto crafting. I've been told that we can put a timer there and activate this with redstone, which I didn't realize. So rather than having to press start, you can just let that run, which like that doesn't say that anywhere. And it doesn't like show that you can do that. And that is quite irritating. So... So hopefully we can do that and let that run. And we might, I might, if we've got time, I might try to do, whilst that is kind of running, I might try and do these two um, achievements as well, whilst we're just kind of waiting for stuff to happen. So I'm going to go to the end, get some stuff, and I will see you back here. Okay, I am back. I, I, oh, hey, that's not what I wanted at all. That was a good start there. Um, I'm back. I got my 10 dragon hearts uh, and my 10 dragon eggs. There we go. There they are. So that is all going well. We need to put that and that, I think, here as well. Uh, let's put you there. Let's put you there and there. And I think that should... What have I got wrong? What have I got wrong? Uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Have I not got six? Oh no, I I don't. I don't. I've got one. Oh no, wait, I do. Um, is that not correct? I'm very confused. Oh, I need to do four. Of course I do. Of course I do. Oh, silly actor. Okay. It's okay. I can I can rectify this. I can rectify this. Uh, so four and then there we go. That should there we go. That there we go. And I think actually I need another four. But what I want to know is if we can actually use this to uh, to set it off. So let's try that. Yes, yes, we can. Ah, oh, that is so awesome. Oh, that's going to make my life a lot easier. Do another four. There we go. So, we should be able to basically just drop all of this in like that. And that should... As soon as this finishes, that should kind of come out. Um, so, let's just check. I keep picking up... Oh, I need to... Let's turn you off. and Let's just put you back. That would be better. That would be better. There we go. Right, let's put you back and you back. That has... Yeah, that's come in there. Let's see if this starts again. Yes, it does. Oh, that is joyous. That is really quite nice. Let's get rid of you as well. So that is working. That is doing its thing. I'm currently just making more um, Awakened Draconium so that I can have enough to make all the chaotic stuff, basically. That's, that's what we're doing right now. So we're not even making... The chaotic stuff. I think we're building up so that I have enough to make all of this, essentially. Um, and I might need to do even more for this. Oh, man. Need so much stuff. So, I'm going to get crafting, basically. I'm going to kind of leave this crafting. Uh, get this started. I might have to make a few more awakened draconium blocks, I kind of think. So I might as well do it now whilst I'm kind of doing it. So that's what I'm going to do. And then I will do more stuff. Right then. So... I have the required amount of this stuff. I have 4 times 32 of these cores. I like that. So let's just put them on here. There we go. You there. And then we have a 32 nether stars. Boom. And that should get us 
that many awakened cores. Now this will basically do its thing, which is the lovely thing that I can now leave this. Now I know it will go slow, but uh, it will just kind of do its thing. So whilst we're doing that, whilst that is kind of crafting up, uh, we're going to have a little look at this. So the absorber to create a custom liquid block um, or block dimension. So and then create a dimension of rarity four or high consisting of large liquid orbs. So obviously the easiest thing to do is combine those things. So I was looking, I was looking uh, through here to see, you know, what kind of rarity um, had. And I thought we should look at the liquid stuff. Liquid. Uh, and it's got a lot of types of liquid. Obviously, yeah, huge liquid orbs that we can actually make, I think. Aha, yes, because I, at some point I did a feature absorber uh, with the, um, with one of our, old worlds uh, so we've got that if you don't know how to do that go look at my kind of my RF tools dimensions um, video because I I kind of go through a lot of worlds and you basically just have to find you have to stumble on one that has uh, liquid orbs and then you can get that as a feature so we can get that now uh, and some of these yeah some of these are in like weird stuff now vapor of if you have a look at that that, I believe, is Vapor of Levity. Uh, there's only one Vapor in the pack, uh, so I think it's Vapor of Levity, and that is Rarity 5, so that is what we need. So I just need to get a Liquid Absorber with enough um, Vapor of Levity in. And I, it just so happens that I have, obviously, over here, where is it? I have, well, that isn't empty, but it's got that many buckets of uh, Vapor of Levity. So I don't know... I don't know how much I actually need for this. Um, let's see. Is that going to... Are you going to absorb that? Doesn't feel like it's absorbing that, does it? Huh. Like, I don't... I don't feel you've absorbed any of that. Um, Maybe if we were to do it like that... Uh, oh, can I pick your air? Uh, actually, let's go one higher. And then put you there. And then you there. Aha. Ah, yes, it has done it. There we go. So that's how, for some reason, you have to do it. The vapor of levity. So there you go. So I know this is a little tedious. But actually, you know, it's it's fairly easy just for, for this one thing to do it like that. 7%. So this is what I'm doing whilst I'm waiting for all of those things to craft. Look at that. Big ball of goodness. And I think next episode we're going to make that a little bit nicer because I don't like the way that looks. Uh, we need to kind of spruce that up a little bit. Uh, just before, you know, I'll give you guys the world download on the last episode. I want to make this place look, you know, properly nice. So that's what we're going to be doing. So, yep, more more little things to do. We are nearly there, 99%, 100%, there we go. That wasn't too bad, that was not too bad. Uh, let's go back up here, boom. And let's put you in here now, because basically this should mean that I, oh, there it is, in fact. Bam, yes, vapor of levity. So we have that, and we have that. So, um, to construct this dimension, I believe you put you put that the whatever you want to affect before the actual uh, feature dimlet. So if you wanted, well, basically we want a vapor of levity, uh, a huge liquid orb kind of dimension. So we need to put the liquid before the actual feature itself. I do believe. Now I think we might need some some more dimlets for like digits. Uh, dim. Where have we got any? Have we got any at all? Have we not? Have I kind of lost all my digit dimlets? Just to make sure that it doesn't interfere with any of our other ones. Uh, digit dimlets. What do I need? What else do I need? Oh, paper. We've got no paper. There we go. Uh, let's do that. There we go. And let's make you, well, one of you into... That's a two. Excellent. And let's put one of you into a four. There we go. So we can have the number 42 because 
Uh, when we did the terrain scanner, someone said it kind of reminded them of uh, of Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Now, if you haven't seen that um, or you know read it, then uh, it's a it's a very cool. It's a very good book. It's a very good book, and the number forty two features prominently uh, within that. So this should this should be okay. I mean, the only thing that I'm really bothered about is that essentially. So. Have I got any kind of blank dimlet things? I bet I don't, actually. Uh, oh, no, they're not called dimlets. They're called tabs, I think. Um, realized, realized, realized. So we don't have... Of course we don't. Of course we don't. We don't have a blank one, so let's just quickly do that. Where? There we go. More paper have we got? Yes, we've got enough. We've got enough. We have enough. Let's go back over here. Back over here. Um... Boom. Um, let's just call it vapor. Store. There we go. And let's now. I think this is the dragon one. Here be dragons. Yes, we don't need that right now. Boom. Let's let this load up. Um, and let's also see how far this has gone. So, whew, it's yeah, it's done twelve. That's not too terrible. Not too terrible, so this needs to kind of go a little bit more. But um, I'm going to let this kind of build up, and then we'll we'll go check it out. And then we can check that achievement, and then get on with more chaotic stuff. Okay, here we are in the huge liquid orb dimension. Look at this. Uh, and there's chickens on here. What is this made out of? Oh, chiseled dirt. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, now, because vapor of levity goes up, we should basically... Oh... Oh, that was a bit weird. That's a little bit of lag there. Wow, that is laggy. But yes, there you go. That is that is vapor of levity. And let's uh, let's put that up. And that is because most likely we're getting a lot of lag because vapor of levity is very laggy, very laggy indeed. But this is totally done. Um, so I think we can go home. And that is, we've definitely checked this off the achievement list, which I'm very happy about. There we go. We are we are back home. So let's do that. Boom and boom. Age of the Traveler is done. It is done. And um, we most likely can do this, but I might just save that until next episode. Oh, uh, quantum storage unit. Um, actually, if we go over there, because it'll be nicer. Let's go. Oh no. Let's go there. There we go. If we look. If we look on here. Oh no. Hey. Let's go down. There we go. I like looking here because, I mean, you can see how much is in it. But here, we get to see a percentage. 70%. 70%. So this is, we are, we're kind of almost there on that one. So not too much longer. So I'm going to let all the, you know, all that crafting, fusion crafting happen. And then we can get on with more chaotic stuff. Because I want those chaotic solar panels. Oh, yeah. Right, that was the last one. We now have 32 awakened cores, which is quite quite a thing. Um, so, what I've kind of realized is that I think the easiest way of doing this is doing it one at a time. Say, if we have a look at that. So, I need, what, one of, oh, no, we need to make these first. Ah, yes, so I need my chaos shards. Where did I put my chaos shards? Are they in here? Yes, I've... Oh, hang on. I've only got five. I've only got five. I forgot because we've got, we've not got enough with the, um, because I only got five because of the silly glitch. I should have, I should probably have ten. So, <sighs> okay. So I'm going to have to actually go kill two more Chaos Dragons. That is such an annoying thing. But, uh, what I was going to say in the meantime, where, what was I doing? What was I up to? I did something else, basically. I got I I went to get more dragon eggs because this is what I did. This is what I did. Um, I put in the crafting recipe for uh, draconic solar panels. So I kind of did all of that uh, because obviously we need four of those to make three chaotic ones. Uh, so if we put in four, we can actually. There we go. I needed four more dragon eggs to be able to do that, but we can definitely get that cell like kind of set up and done so i'm gonna kill two more chaos um guardian dragons i might as well because well you know it's kind of done already 
I should, what I should do is put all of this safely here. Um, because I probably will die again. Can I? Oh, wow. Is this full? Oh, this is either full or this has basically, this has glitched out. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, I, I think I've glitched out. Look at that. That, yeah. Oh, that's, that's let me do that. Oh, wow. Look at that. Look. Oh, oh, what? What is happening? Did everything just end up in my... <laughs> What's happening? Why have I not got anything? Uh, ah, oh, and everything's back again. Well, something crazy is happening. So I'm going to I'm gonna stop recording and let, let stuff calm down. Okay, then. Done. That was painful. Um, I died uh, once doing it, uh, but I got the other two. Uh, and I'm doing these chaos kind of chaotic cause now so i'm just gonna let this run um make that a little bit better i lost a lot of levels when i di when i did die but this shouldn't be too bad so we are so close so close to making the solar panels those things did craft and that is why i think i was having like horrific random lag um I think it was just the crafting core kind of doing its thing. So we are very close um, to making uh, to making these. Um, oh, I need a, do I need another four awakened cores? Ah, I've completely forgotten about that, haven't I? Completely forgotten about more awakened cores. <sighs> okay, well that's fine. I can we can make those. That's not too bad. So another another what four I need. Another four awakened cores. Of course I do. <laughs> of course I do. So I'm going to do that as well. I'm just going to let all of this run. And then the next shot will be us making the... Um, well, actually, I might just make the chaotic infusion things uh, myself. You kind of... You, you know what's going to be the case. You know how it'll happen. So I won't show that. I want to just get on to the actual solar panels. Would you look at that? I have seven so far. And this is number eight. Number eight. So, finally, we have this. This took quite a while of doing, as you can imagine. There we go. Right. So, um, what we can do now is, I believe it's four of these and then four awakened cores. So let's let's see. Let's see if this if this happens. That looks quite nice, actually. Quite like that. That little layout. Um, then we have. So we need to put them in the chaotic ones. Got to be careful of that, because I have just a normal one up there. Uh, and then we put in this, I think. Yes! Oh, yes, look at that! And then we get three chaotic solar panels, which is excellent. Let's uh, do a bit of that. Oh, wow, that is... Is that how slow it is? Wow! That is ridiculously slow. Let's um, Let's do a little bit of this. There we go. Nice. That feels... That feels like really slow. And I'm wondering, have I used... Literally, have I used a... A whole kind of tier 7's worth of energy just making these? Because I kind of didn't really pay much attention to the energy requirements. Because, you know, I thought, hey, you know what, we've got like... We've got loads, but let's have a look. Let's have a quick look. <gasps> oh no, no, we're fine. We are totally fine. Like we still got, we still got loads. So why, why is that going so slowly? Is that just how long it takes? It must be. It totally must be. Ninety six. Okay, we are crafting, so I'm hoping now... Yeah, that looks... that's a lot faster. Oh, we have it, we have it, we have three chaotic solar panels. That is insane. Uh, let's go up there then. Let's go back up there. Can we... thank you. And I'm going to take these guys away because we don't need them anymore. We don't need these little poxy ones. There we go, like that. And then let's put on these super kind of chaotic ones there we go bam and bam and now look at that look at that so we should have basically as standard one and a half million rf kind of going in which is insane 
that is that is crazy and it's still really not enough by far to kind of fill this bad boy but we're not we're not kind of going for the filling this that will that will that will do it so thank you so much for watching hope you've enjoyed it hope you've enjoyed this kind of chaotic interlude uh, if you did, a like or comment is always very much appreciated. And of course, make sure to subscribe to stay up to date with my channel and all of that kind of stuff as well. Thank you so much for watching. I've been Hector, this has been Sky Factory 3, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.